Ow, oh, to the hospital, big bitty. Like, so. So I'm not controlling the Harry very well here. So I couldn't hold on to the controller. I was holding it in a very weird fashion, I can tell you that for a start. I run down here, and on the fourth floor, there is that guy with three heads. Three heads are better than one. You'd think so, wouldn't you? And here we are, seventh floor. So we only have to teach a few people spells. Uh, Joe's one comes last by default, I believe. Yeah, it does. Right. Okay, let's learn reductive. Are you ready to teach us something? Can we do something cool? Please, Harry. I'll see what I can find. Come on, Harry. You must know something good you can teach us. I think I know just the spell. How about this one, Harry? Reducto. Reducto? Didn't you use that during the Triwizard Tournament? It says you need to aim, then rotate your wand anti-clockwise, and say, Reducto. Yes. Here we go. Reducto! Like that. Reducto! Just not moving. That's it done. Brilliant! Well done, Jimmy. Blowing things up comes naturally when you're growing <laughs> up with friend George. Right. Let's see if anyone here is as good as Ginny. Thanks for teaching that to us, Harry. In an instant. So that's Reducto learned. Who else do we need to talk to? Colin Creevy of Pomona Sprouts One Can Wait. Hey! We'll talk to Zacharias. When are you going to teach us something useful? How about Harry teaches how to keep your big gob shut? <laughs> That'd be useful. It's okay, Ron. I know just the spell to teach Zacharias. I'm sure Zacharias won't mind if he helps you show the others the spell. <laughs> yes, here it is. Rick de Sempra. Rick de Sempra. Yes. You need to touch Rick de Sempra was a spell in like all this. three uh, in Chamber Secrets and Protest of Azkaban PS. Uh, right. Yes, a PC, sorry. Rick de Sempra is completely one. useless. It doesn't do anything. It just confuses a person. Like oh. that. Rick de Sempra! This will be cool. <laughs> Brilliant! Well done, everyone! Hey! I haven't had a chance to practice it yet! Oh, sorry, Zacharias. That's all the time we have to practice that spell. Maybe you can do it another time. <laughs> that was a great lesson, Harry. And last person, Colin Creevy. Hey, Harry. Where is he? Here. Hi, Harry. I can't wait for this lesson. Are we going to do something exciting? I bet we are. Uh, yeah. Can we blow something up? Or try and turn someone into a ferret? Or what's that spell where you make somebody completely freeze so they can't move? Petrificus Totalis. <laughs> okay, this is quite a simple spell, but it's very useful. To paralyze an opponent, you need to point your wand and tap it, as I'm yes, doing. Yes, Hermione is very good at instructing. You just circle round to our clockwise. <laughs> I don't know how I'll become your test subject. <laughs> For fuck's sake, what the hell was that? Wow, bit? Harry, you're the greatest teacher ever. Thanks. Let's teach the others. And that's that. If I'm right, it'll be Cho's lesson now, yeah. Cho's always comes last regardless. Hi, Harry. What are you going to teach us today? As it's the last lesson before Christmas, could you teach us something yes. fun? Yes. I think I know just the thing. Can you turn to Levy Corpus, Hermione? How does he know about Levy Corpus? Right. It says here that you hold your wand up and move it like this. Oh, it's the Wingardium Levy or some movement. Okay. So, so it goes like this. Levy Corpus. I said I believed you, Harry. Yes, shut Don't up. Don't worry, you did quite well. Okay, no, you were terrible, but I knew <laughs> you I watched you while we were doing the other spells. You did? Yeah. Uh, come on. I hear comes up the epic scene. Don't go, Harry. I... I want...
want to talk to you. Oh, here comes you know what scene. I think we all know what's gonna happen next. Are you alright? I might hide this or something. You're a really good teacher, Harry. Yeah, I'm going to hide it. Mistletoe. Um. I'm not gonna look. I'm not paying any attention to see what they're doing. <laughs> okay, here we go with another. And yet another vision from Harry. Oh no! I, Arthur Weasel is about to be attacked! No! Harry! Harry! Ron! It's your dad! Quick! <laughs> you need to get to McGonagall! Harry, what's the matter? I can't explain now. We have to find Professor McGonagall. Come on! Yes! Oh, pardon me. You were just dreaming, weren't you? Dumbledore will know what to do. Okay, and it's night time, so there's no to hear. Now, do you where think you're do you going think you're going, going this, this hour? It's Ron's dad. He's been attacked by a snake. Harry was screaming in his sleep. I wasn't dreaming. Mr. Weasley collapsed. I yes. saw it. Calm down. I believe you, Potter. Now, you and Mr. So we'll Weasley will go straight to the headmaster's office. office. I will collect young Ginny and your brothers. Off you go now. There's no time to waste. No. Okay. Come on, Harry. Let's get okay. to Dumbledore's office. Okay. Straight to the Dumbledore's office is on the ground floor. All you have to do is to find a way down to the bottom. You cannot deviate by taking, like, if you can't go, like, up here, it won't let you. So all the portraits and floors are closed. So you can't deviate and you're not allowed to explore, technically. So you're just going to basically rush down to the bottom. Oh, for fuck's sake. What the hell? I would appreciate it if the game didn't do that. Fuck's sake, it's hard to control Harry when he's in his different uniform. But like, come on. So come on. You won't be able to get very far on the dungeon floor, bay. If you try to talk to a portrait, they'll just snore at you. Keep the noise down. Like that. So yeah, none of the portraits will work. And Dumbledore's office is just down here for some strange reason. He's not even here though. And if you go down here you'll see you can't get very far. Well, I suppose you could go down to here. But there's nothing down here because that's all blocked up anyway so it's useless. I don't know where Ron is, he seems to just obliterate himself. And uh, down here, and that's that. Phineas, I need you to go to your portrait at Grimald Place. Tell them Arthur Weasley has been gravely injured. Professor, please! What's happening to me? You wished to see me, Headmaster? Uh oh. Yes, Severus. I'm afraid we daren't wait, even until morning. Potter, come with me. Sir? Now, Potter. <laughs> Vault and Molly, we've made sure that your father will be found by the right people. Yes. Okay, here's the annoying bit that we have to do. Why am I here? What? You are here to Occlumency. learn Occlumency. Yes. The art of magical You have to do this at random points throughout the game, so the don't worry about it. It's actually pretty simple. I'll tell you about it as you we do it. Learn to control this. You mean he can read my yes. mind? Read it, control it, unhinge it. If he becomes aware of the connection, Occlumency will help yes. you shield yourself. I am about to attempt to break into your mind. Led Jilly Men's. Okay. So basically, a memory is going to appear and Snape's wand is going to be in a direction, right? You basically got to push his wand in the opposite direction. It must be opposite. So if he's pointing it up, right, you have to point the what the So if it's pointing right, you have to use the right analog stick to push it the opposite direction. So if it's up, you push it down. If it's left to the right, etc. And just repeat until the game tells you that you've done it. Like so. And Snape's um, image will get smaller and smaller. For some... There we go, another one. And you'll just see him just dive back.
This isn't too difficult, it's just tiring on your arm. And uh, I'll be defeated there. Snape has been defeated, and that's that. Adequate, Potter. Yes. For a first attempt, it was not as poor as it might have been. Will I have to do many lessons, sir? Evidence yes. suggests that you are sharing the dark. We just have to we have some emotions. choice. It is inadvisable that such a And yeah, all the like Snape's task won't be able to be done now. So you know that bit with the moonstone essay, you'd have to do it before now or wait mind. till the end of term before attempting to do it. Of all emotion. Because it won't work, so to speak. But here we are, Grimald Place for Christmas. Yep, so here we are back at Grimald Place again for the last time in ever. It's almost time for you to return to Hogwarts. Before you go, why don't you go and have some fun with your friends? Let Arthur know when you want to leave. Yes. Okay, there's nothing really to do here. It's like one task on one of the floors, but that's it. There's nothing else. What are you doing, Ginny? Creature's been hiding things, so we can't throw them out. <laughs> Mum's asked me to find anything we might have missed in here. Be careful, though. Um... Order of Merlin, first class. This was awarded to Sirius's grandfather. Sirius said his grandfather gave the Ministry lots of gold. <laughs> Weird, isn't it? Sirius being related to someone who acts like Lucius Malfoy. <coughs> They're related. Lucius Malfoy married Narcissa Black. That means Sirius has Draco in his family. No wonder Sirius doesn't want anything to do with it. <coughs> mm, let's see what else there is. Okay. Depulso! Ugh. I feel so sleepy. Careful, Harry. Mm, let's see what else there is. Accio! Wingardium Leviosa! That's another one. What's that book? Nature's Nobility. A wizarding genealogy. Yeah. Nature's Nobility? Let's see what else there is. And there's another item. Look at this. Hmm, won't open. Thanks, Harry. That's everything, yeah. I think that's everything. I'd better pack. I'll see you later. Yay, done. So that's all to do, I think. If we go upstairs, there's nothing else there either. That's just Sirius's mother screaming in her head off. These two doors go absolutely nowhere because there's nothing behind them. Up here to the right is... Can't go there. Can't go there, so I have to just go in here. Have you seen Creature? I want to give him his Christmas present. No, I haven't seen him. Hi. Hi, Harry. Listen, mate, about my dad. I know. I'm sorry. Sorry? You saved his life. I'm not sure. I think... I think it was me who did it. It couldn't have been you, could it? <laughs> like mine is always saying. You yes, I feel a loud gap in silence and such, so it been again. You. I mean, there's nothing whatsoever in Grimald Place, so you can just ignore it, basically. Nothing there either. Up here, I think there's just two doors that have nothing at all. Fuck me! I bet he feels as trapped as Sirius does. And that's the house. And annoyingly, we can't. And there's no items to cast spells on, so we just have to run all the way back down the stairs for absolutely no reason whatsoever. <coughs> Shut up. For fuck's sake. Uh, that's the exit out of Grimble Place, so we obviously can't go out there. In here, there's just Sirius 
the noble and most ancient this house of black thing. The strange. They're in Azkaban. I used to be there until mother blasted me off. I hated a lot of them. Went to live with your father. You haven't seen Creature, have you? No. He's been missing for quite some time. No, I haven't seen him. You don't think he could have left the house, do you? He might despise me, but he still has to have my permission. No, he's skulking around here somewhere. Yes, of course. I better look for him. That's that. In serious, I'll just exit out of here and walk all the way around. Up the stairs. Why? Creature has. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> well, they can't point out what it's serious. Serious will just walk around in circles, so. I'll just go to here, walk along, and turn back, so. Shit, not there. I'll go down here. I know I like we can only walk down here, it's stupid. Well, when we get run control again, we can. Let's talk to Mr. Weasley over here. Are you alright, Mr. Weasley? Absolutely, Harry. St. Mungo's was an interesting experience. Yes. You know, a trainee healer there showed me some old muggle remedies. Did you know they use things called stitches to sew wounds back together? Fascinating. Fascinating. Yes. What really happened when you were attacked? It's very simple. I'd had a very long day, dozed off, got sneaked up on and bitten. Are you ready to go back to school? Yes, I'm ready to go. You should speak to Sirius. He's waiting for you in the tapestry yes. room. Yes. So we'll just run up around for absolutely no reason. And that door will magically open for you for some strange reason. Why is it we must walk up these stairs? It's stupid. And thank goodness this is the last time we get to see... If my mistress only knew the vermin infesting our house. It would break mistress's heart. My mother didn't have a heart. Now go away, creature. <laughs> Whatever master wishes. Nasty brat. That's creature, he's just a shit face. Wingardium Leviosa! Let's just take this. And shove it all the way down there. So just head to the tapestry room to end the section go back to Hogwarts so time to go back to Hogwarts seems like we're always saying goodbye it won't always be this way you're a good person Harry Harry it's yay back. Hagrid where have you been all this time oh well that's a bit complicated you see I'm have what's going on Hagrid I can't leave without telling uh -oh. someone about him about who I couldn't just leave him See, he's my brother. Oh, here's we see this stupid well, idiot. Half brother. Grob, meet your new friend Hermione. <laughs> That's that. Oh dear. Hagrid's brought a giant back and hit it in the forest. What a douchebag he is. And this time I actually get left off at Hagrid's house. And for some strange reason, the game artist did bother putting hey, any. Harry. And you better get to Snape's Blood office. on him. You've got your next occlumency lesson. Thanks for reminding me. I have to do our next stupid occlumency lesson. Potato! Expel! <laughs> <laughs> I can cast as many spells as we want at Hag and see, we'll do anything. <laughs> Patricius <Patricomus> took <laughs> They <laughs> won't do anything to it, but I need to fly ball for. Anyway, nothing here, so we'll just go all the way back to Snape's dungeon, so I'll cut here and see you there. Um, I just remembered something that was missing one of the portrait passwords that'll take us a shortcut to Snape's dungeon. Um, so 
go to the Gryffindor common room. How are we want to do it? I just used this way because it's quicker than wasting time trying to get out of the stairs. Uh, wrong way, sorry. I keep getting confused by that to one. So go to the Gryffindor common room on the seventh floor. You want to get your invisibility cloak. There's a reason for this, because the portrait for the dungeons is at oops, uh, the dungeon portrait requires you to get your invisibility cloak. Strange little camera glitch. So put the invisibility cloak on. I love this thing. This will help. So go all the way down to the bottom of the grand staircase, however way you need to do it. Without taking portrait shortcuts, I suppose. Oh, fuck it. Okay, so find the bottom of the staircase. Where Hannah Abbott was. That's where you need to go. Come back here, swing bag. Thank you. Day for learning, yes. The reason I'm going to show you this now is because it's quite a good shortcut to take. But the problem is you need the invisibility cloak to get it. Which is a strange password. It's a strange way of getting a password. So enter here and you'll get a cutscene. Oh. Oh shit, I've made a mistake. You need to activate this. So, what I'm going to do is cut here and like, and jump back when we've actually gotten what we need to do. So, you rejoin me back on the bottom of the grand staircase where we need to find a password for here. Um, you don't have... Oh, just remember there's some pieces behind here. Look so. We just will complete this dungeon corridor. 100%. Like so. Is there a secret passage behind your portrait? And what is that to you, boy? You are not Slytherin, so you cannot pass. Damn, Slytherin Unless only portrait. You have the password, of course. No, I don't. I thought not. Still, you could try asking some Slytherin students. I'm sure they'd be happy to help you. Seen and not heard, that's what you mean. Okay, so go all the way back up to the, uh, the figgy, the common room again, and get the invisibility cloak, then come back down here, and you'll find some people we will tell you the password without too much problem. Password? I forgot you've got to activate that scoundrel. thing first. Which is a mistake anyone could make. So we'll go down to here. For oh, fuck's sake, stop that. Up here we go. Um Cloak. I love this thing. Yes, you said that before. Let's see Umbridge catch me now. Ah <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. So go all the way back down to the Oh fuck it, I hate it when this happens. It just glitches, I don't know why. Well it doesn't glitch, it just Jams in place. I hate that person with Percival Pratt, whatever his name is. This is the annoying bit, it's trying to. Um, I don't know. Go all the way down to the bottom, and you'll get a cutscene. 
where two servers used are debating whether they should use the secret passage, aka the one we're trying to get into. Like so. We got potions. We'll be late. Not if we use the secret passage near the entrance of the dungeon corridor. Then we'll get there in no time. Do you know the password? Of course. Such a shame people who aren't in Slytherin don't. <laughs> so, they all just walk off. Can you remember the password? Of course. Just make sure there's no one here with me when we go in. Yes. But unfortunately, I don't realise we are here. Here we are. Password. Slytherins are supreme. Thank you for telling us the password. Ah, Slytherins. And remember, be nasty to mudbloods. Ah, <laughs> oh, what a cruel thing to say. It seems that it's a Slytherin bitch. Slytherins are supreme. Not now. I know their precious past. <laughs> to go all the way back up to the, the dormitory, take the cloak off, and then come back down. So I'll see you back down here. So you rejoin me back in the dungeon corridor, but we're just about to go through this porch over here. Keep the noise down. Slytherins are supreme. What? Ha! You're not that supreme after all, are you? <laughs> Seen and not heard, that's what children should be. Slytherins are supreme. Yes, no. I don't think. If I didn't have to open, the music that's playing currently is the same music that plays in Chipper Secrets PS1 when you're in the dungeons. Now go over here, and in this titsy little room is nothing except the Baron's portrait. It's a tiny room, it's hard to get in here. When your people are in the way, come back here! God's sake. And that's all the house ghosts. What stupider than two Hufflepuffs flying a broom backwards? <laughs> Discovered all the house ghosts in Hogwarts. You've not yes, I don't care. So that's all that's in there. Umbridge is the best. Oh no. Here's another one of these things, so we'll just try and complete off the dungeon section now. Draco Malfoy would always beat Potter to the snitch if Potter did 